This video is brought to you by the Dollar Shave Club. These are photos that will change the way you see the world. As someone who lived in LA all his life, I haven't been able to travel very much. So I'm not very aware of other countries or other places in the world besides besides like a 10 mile radius around my house. For example, I knew there was an end of the Great Wall of China, but I didn't expect it to look like this. This is the end of the Great Wall of China. If you walked the whole Great Wall, this is the final destination you're gonna arrive to. And uh, I think it's pretty crazy. So to think about it, there is a loophole to the Great Wall of China. You just have to get through the ocean to get to China. Just, I mean, walk through the beach, walk around it, and you're in China. China. What's up, guys? Welcome to React Time. We're looking at some pictures that will change the way you think about how the world really is. These are really fascinating. This is the place, exactly what it looks like, where old tires actually just get piled up. This is it. And it looks incredible. Like, I've never seen that many tires in my life. I don't know where this is. This is a real picture. It's not Photoshop, and it's absolutely incredible. I always thought they reused the rubber in the tire, but maybe not. This is Cairo, Egypt, and um, it's not what it looks like or what you thought it looked like in the photos. See, in the photos, you think it looks something like this. Just sand for miles and miles, but in reality, there's a whole city around it. I did not know that, and I feel like a lot of you guys didn't know that as well. Now you know. It is totally modern, and there is not much sand left, more like a huge city. Here's another picture of a pizza hut right next to the pyramid. This is so weird. An American brand, an American pizza shop, actually just maybe a mile off the giant pyramid. A guy literally eating pizza enjoying himself. That's just so weird. It looks like it's green screened in. This is a 360 degree rainbow that is seen from an airplane. So maybe rainbows aren't just 180 degrees and they're full 360. So that is very strange. Something to think about. This looks like Air Force One flying by Mount Rushmore. It can't get more patriotic than this. So I wonder if every route that the airplane flies by, if it goes out of the country, does it fly by Mount Rushmore? Or is this just a cool picture take at the right moment? I'm not sure. But if you guys know, leave it down in the comments. So this is what Mercury actually looks like. I did not know it looks so sparkly and actually pretty amazing. I always thought Mercury looked pretty disgusting. See, a lot of people think Mercury just looks like this. But in reality, it looks more like something with all this color. That is incredible. Now you think this is from Doctor Strange. Well, it's not. This is Barcelona. Spain, Barcelona. And the architecture is absolutely amazing. They literally made it into blocks. I've never seen a city look like this in my life. If I ever go to Barcelona, I definitely want to see what this looks like in person. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to be airborne, but I'm going to be in the street just looking at squares of streets. All right, so here's something cool. Can you guys guess where this is? I'll give you five seconds. Comment down below. No cheating. You have to do it. Don't wait for the answer and then comment it. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. That was a fast is five seconds. This is Google's data center and I'm actually pretty amazed that they colored every single, it looks like pipes. It could be cables, but yeah, it definitely looks like pipes. This is the data center and they color coded pipes. It looks like it's something straight out of a fiction movie. I did not know they spent this much money on this and this is amazing. That, like think about how cool it would be to work in a place like this. Also another headquarters is cool. This is in Dublin. This is one of Google's places in Dublin. This is Google's California headquarters. It just looks so amazing. Like the design, it's pretty phenomenal. So a while back, Mount Everest was something almost everybody wants to accomplish in their life. It's one of the greatest accomplishments you can make, but um, not anymore. It seems like a lot of people are accomplishing it. There's a line of people walking behind each other, conquering Mount Everest together, so you might not feel as special as if you did it a few years ago, because now everybody wants to do it. Now, I know this looks like a museum, right? But as you know, there is a very famous painting that everybody's trying to take a picture of, except it's super far away. If you zoom in really close, you'll see the Mona Lisa. That's right. So you think it's only one or two people that just walk by, take a photo. This is what it looks like inside the museum, inside the museum that has the original Mona Lisa. That really reminds me of the photo of the Eiffel Tower reality. That really reminds me of this photo. So you always thought Eiffel Tower, there's always grass, barely any people, you know, but um, if you want to have a nice picnic, it's going to be super loud because this is what the Eiffel Tower looks like in reality. Here are the two sides to New York City, the super, super busy street side with all the tall buildings and then the very calm park full of trees side. This is the Hollywood sign from space. If you zoom in close, Mostly you can still see it. That's how large it is. Uh, you can literally see it from space. This is a photo capture from space. This is the Burning Man Festival. It's actually huge. I did not expect it to be this big. It literally looks like a little city full of cars. That it has to be one of the coolest places to go to. But kind of scary too. Random sandstorms. I don't, I don't know. Guys, if you want to check this photo out, first link in the description. There's so many more photos. Okay, pause guys. Before we continue, I want to let you guys know about the amazing shades I've been getting. 
with the Dollar Shave Club. Especially with their shave butter, my skin feels so smooth. I'm a full-fledged member of the Dollar Shave Club, and now I'm adding even more Dollar Shave Club products to my membership. They don't just make products for your face, they also make products for your hair. It makes you smell, feel, and look amazing. It's delivered straight to your door, so you don't have to go out and buy new razors every single time. They even have butt wipes! Yeah, so you guys can get your first month of their best razor and the trial size version of their shave butter, body cleanser, and again, even the butt wipes for just $5. This is exclusively for reaction time subscribers. It's going to be the first link in the description, dollarshaveclub.com slash reaction time. Replacement cartridges ship for just a few bucks every single month. If you don't believe me, try it out right now. Let's get back to the video and hope you guys enjoy. They don't just change the way you look at this world. It is absolutely amazing. Places that we all need to go to and travel and explore. But that's going to wrap it up. Check out some more videos. Maybe check out the collaboration channel with me and my friends right here. Or you can subscribe to this channel just by clicking that circle. Um, that's going to wrap it up, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any more video ideas or suggestions, send it to me at reactiontimevideos at gmail.com. Go follow my Instagram and Twitter. But until then, I'll see you next time. Have a good one and peace out.